greetings. So for this, I will say I did get a lot of repeat questions. So if I don't answer yours in particular, it's not that I don't like you. It's just that I saw somebody else ask it first. So let me just unshuffle this tissue box of questions. Jesus Christ is in the most comments I've gotten on anything. I got a lot of people asking about my characters, especially the avatar that I use for this. I'll just answer everybody at once. The avatar that I use, name is Entity. She's a sentient mass of corrupted dad that mimics a human form. Pretty poorly, might I add. There's a reason why her proportions are so messed up. I would label her as a demon, but that's not entirely true. She's based on the Entity from Dead by Daylight, Upgrade from Ben 10, and the Guardians from Ranworld. And just generally, I had a persona that kind of looked like her before that was just me, so I kind of mushed their appearances together to make uh, the squid. Okay, now getting into more specific questions that aren't just that. What do you think about the strict no-spoilers attitude in the Rainbow community? I'm quite annoyed with it considering how hard it is to get lore from the game. Ironically, abandoning that attitude and letting myself get spoiled let me enjoy the game myself and also watch your videos. I'm with you on that, honestly. It's one of the reasons why I don't talk in the official Discord server that much. I think that, personally, a person should be first given the initiative to explore the game first. Because there's two things that I hate more than anything. It's backseat gamers and people who gatekeep spoilers like us the fucking Pantheon. Here are a few. What's the story behind your character's avatar? If there is any notable story. Entity is just what I want to go by online. Her design is simple and recognizable. But your nationality? I was born on Earth, allegedly. Experience in video games. What if you played like, dislike, and how long? Uh, I've been playing games since I was like six, I think. My first game was Duck Hunt on my dad's Nintendo we had up in the attic. I played mostly Pokemon and Mario and a lot of other really niche games that we had on my Xbox. I think the only game that I've ever played in... I don't know. If I dislike a game, I'm not gonna play it for very long. I don't understand, you know, playing a game and it's like, no, it, it gets better over time. Like, but I don't want to wait for the game to get better. I don't- the game- the game's supposed to be fun. I don't want to wait for something to be fun. If it's not fun immediately, I'm not gonna play it. What do you think about the more Let's Play oriented channel? Regularly playing new games. If I do keep doing Let's Play videos, they'll be shortened to like, 10 minute videos and kept to one or two. I use Downpour as a test drive, honestly. I think the reason why my Downpour videos aren't as well known as the stuff that I'm putting out now is because the videos are so fucking long. If you manage to sit through my 30 minute long video of the Saint finale, you got some fucking balls on you, dude. Like, what kind of patience do you have? What's your opinion on dad zombies? I know it's easy to talk similarly, so I imagine you've watched them extensively. Baz is cool. I've been on his server since it first opened. I honestly doubt he knows who I am. <laughs> who do you think is the worst slug cat to play as? Enot, I hated it. You beat the game, you only get as a dating sim for slug cats. I don't want to romance small animals. I want to kill people. I must use so frequently. Choose violence. Because I can, and I will, and I'll do it again. Can we have a ref of your Sona? I really want to draw them. I also recommend Stray. It's a fun game with a good storytelling. Uh, sure, I'll post a link in the description when I can. I have a toy house, but uh, it's under construction right now, so I will have to do. I have actually played through Stray. Not all of it. I know what happens at the end. But during gameplay, the game just started breaking to the point where I could hardly play it. Not like graphical glitches or items not appearing. I mean like 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 stuff like this. I gave up fixing it long ago and I don't really feel the need to go back. It was a fun game when it worked though. How did you learn to enjoy black licorice? I like how that became like such a notable thing about me. Unironically, the reason why I like it is the same reason why others hate it. Because it tastes like medicine. Listen, the liquid medication I was forced to take as a kid tasted like bile, to the point where cough medicine actually tasted so much better. So it's an odd sense of nostalgia. Plus it freaks people out when I say I like it and it's funny. Do you know One Shot? I played it a long time ago, but I can't remember anything from it. Does pineapple belong on pizza? Does pizza belong on pineapple? No. You belong on pizza. Would you eat a slug cat if they were real? If yes, which one would you eat? Yes, I would eat Gourmand. He's fat and stubby. I bet he tastes like soy sauce. What's better, Europe or USA? Love for the Rain World series. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. And the answer is neither. Yeah! Could you explain what the burb state from your earliest videos is? No. Why are you? I don't know. One day I was, and now I am. So, mind telling us more about your cat? 
I own three actually, but sure. Susie is a princess, Ziggy is fat, and Sam is a dumbass who likes to eat plastic. Do you have a favorite skug? Artificer, I love her. She's red and filled with violence and malice. And do you plan on playing Inv again? If you've played them? <laughs> no. Are you still gonna do Rainworld? I love your content of it. I'll keep going for a while, but I'll probably go on to different games later on. So I know nobody's gonna bring this up, but can you explain why there are three accounts of record of your appearance as the lead suspect in the murder case in 1989? <laughs> 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 what was the most annoying part of your Rainworld sessions? Uh, I think the worst thing was trying to refrain myself from telling every single person that the thing they want me to do, I can no longer do, because I've already edited the next video. Can you please tell the shadow creature that lives in my basement to stop calling me mean words? I cried myself to sleep because of it. Good. Why is your name Opsion? That's a great question. I love Inscription. I'm so happy you reached that milestone. I loved your content very much. Ah, oh, thanks, man. Here are my two questions. What programs do you use? I use OBS for recording, hit film for editing, and sigh for my thumbnails. Number two, where do you see your channel in the future? Honestly, I do have something that I plan on doing later on, but it's a secret, so bear with me on that one. The fuck is my money? It was due yesterday. It's mine now, bitch! Oh my god, Opsiaha! You should start playing Rainworld, and where'd you hear about it? My friend told me about it in like 2017, I believe. I didn't start playing it until 2020, though. I think. I sucked at it at first, as everybody did. What's your favorite piece from Carpenter Brett and Rainworld, and why are they Escape from Midwich Valley and Lovely Arps? Good guesses, but unfortunately, my friend, both of those are wrong. My favorite Carpenter Brett song is Night Prowler. And my favorite Rainworld song is Grumble Bump. I also like Kayava, but I mean, who doesn't like Kayava? Do you know how they make butter? What kind of games do you like to play? Why did you try doing YouTube? My other favorite games are Bioshock, Subnautica, Pokemon Ruby, Inscription, and Godzilla Destroy All Monsters, which is very it's a very weird choice, but trust me, it's one of my favorite games. I tried doing YouTube, uh, I started with the Scav Diet playthrough, which got more attention than I thought, so I just kept going with it, and now people are starting to recognize who I am, so I guess I'm just gonna keep going with this. Plus, honestly, it's really fun to make these. They're Editing is actually a really fun process. I have the most important question. Yes, you do. Where do you see yourself in the next 10 seconds? <laughs> Behind you. Will you try Expedition Mode in the 70 Challenges in Challenge Mode? I am doing the 70 Challenges as we speak, but I probably won't record them because it doesn't seem like it'd be very fun to watch. Would you mind giving us a list of games you'd like to play besides Rain World so we aren't forcing you to play games you don't like? Honestly, man, I'm just gonna do what I want to do. I mean, I'll take suggestions, and if I like them, I'll do them, but you're not forcing me to play anything. You can't. P.S. There's background noise in your mic. I- I know. Yes, it's my computer screaming in pain. When do you plan to do a face reveal? When hell freezes over? Here are my questions. Number one. How did you learn art? Just a pastime, or did you have to learn? I learned over the years. I started when I was super young, and I was watching cartoons, and I thought, Someday, I want to do that. And thus my monstrosities were born. Number two, you sound tired all the time. Are you okay? Yeah, bro, I'm fine. I just just gotta go through this week, and next week, and next, and the next, and the next. If you so oh god, I gotta do fucking gestures. If you suddenly discovered you had the ability to teleport, but every time you did, you had to wear a wildly outrageous costume. Think like feather boas and neon spandex. Where would be the first place you'd teleport to? What extravagant assemble would you be donning when you arrive? <laughs> McDonald's! Congratulations! Thank you! Here are my questions. Number one, will you ever play Subnautica? I've beaten Subnautica, but I'd love to play it again. Why is your weirdness so funny? Uh, uh, uh. Thoughts on the various levels of grilled cheese? Mouse traps, grilled cheese, toasties, paninis. Wait, what the? Is that what they're called? A mousetrap is how I've been making grilled cheese normally, but I'd never heard it be called that before. The actual answer, uh, I like paninis the most. Congrats on 2k, let's go to 3k, yo! Anyway, what's your favorite OC that you have? A favorite one? Oh my god, oh Jesus. Well, uh, aside from Entity, I guess my favorite is this girly right here. There's so much I could say about her, but I think it's best she's left in the dark. For reasons untouched for now, at least. You'll probably see her pop up from time to time. Also, can I make fan art so you can make a playlist of all your fan art? Can you make fan art? Uh, sure, absolutely, go ahead. Just, you know, be sure to mention me so I can see it. Do you do live streams? If don't, do you intend to? Not really. 
my internet is terrible that if I did end up doing a live stream, it would just be potato quality half the time. Favorite rainbow creature. It's a tie between the Maros Vulture and the Eek. On one hand, really fucking cool metal bird. On the other, frog. This whole thing was pretty fun to do, I'm not gonna lie. I, I, I was pretty excited actually to do a Q&A because I like answering questions. I'm gonna keep moving forth from now on. Thank you guys for all the questions and all the support. That's all for today. Bye bye.